Are you out there? Are you watching? You're going to want to get subscribed because we're going on the 100 mile garage sale. Watch this. van can you believe it why 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 well I will tell you why it's empty because I needed room to buy more stuff <laughs> right now I'm pretty sure my husband is rolling his eyes and thinking there's no way you need more stuff but this opportunity only comes around once a year it is the hundred mile garage sale I have a few boxes in here, some moving blankets, some bubble wrap, some newspaper to wrap my smalls, and of course, you know, bottles and bottles of water, uh, junket survival kit, all that good stuff. If you haven't seen the junket survival kit video, click the link in the cards. It's rainy, it's cold, that won't stop us. I am going to be meeting up with my original junk in buddy. My sister, Jennifer, is going with me on the 100 mile garage sale. It is four days of 100 miles, both sides of the Mississippi River in Wisconsin and Minnesota. And we're gonna go from Hastings all the way down to Winona. So it, you're gonna come with me. We're gonna do a series. You'll just have to wait and see all the wonderful, wonderful stuff. We've done this before. Her and I always come out with a ton of stuff. We, the last time we went, the very first day we filled the truck. So this time we're bringing two trucks. First the van and then her truck. And we're gonna use Fluffy basically as our mobile warehouse. So <laughs> every night we will transfer the purchases from her truck into the van for storage and then we'll take a new empty truck out every day so each day of the sale i can't wait to see what we find i can't wait to show you i'm gonna wear my little weird gopro thing so then you can go into some of the sales with us probably not all of them but you know what it's just something you have to see to believe it's gonna be cold it's gonna be rainy we're gonna get wet we don't care. We are going to be there. We're going to go. Come with us. And we're on the road. I'm so excited. So I've got about an hour and a half drive to get to our hotel where I will meet my original junkin' buddy. So let's get going. Hi everyone, it's day one of the 100 mile garage sale. Got my original junkin' buddy here, my sister Jennifer. Say hi to YouTube, Jenny. Hi YouTube. It's the first time you're meeting her. She's my backup for electrical needs in case my dad dies. <laughs> We're gonna go junkin' in Winona and Wabasha today. Yes. Yes. So we're gonna hit Winona and Wabasha. Stay with us. Okay, we finally hit our first sale. So super excited about that. Definitely an antique dealer. Yeah. Who um, I could have bought a lot of stuff there, but there was no meat on the bone. His prices were top of the mark. Did find one vase that he had on sale for four dollars. This cute little fish vase. I will show you guys all the stuff later. But uh, oh, she found another sale. Oh, she takes corners on rails, y'all. <laughs> Jenny got some finds at that one too. She got a vase and a, some horns. Antlers. Antlers. So yeah, so we got a couple good things. Okay, I just had to give an update. First of all, we were getting skunked and we were gonna leave Winona and I'm so glad we didn't because we just hit a garage sale where I got an entire set of Pope Gosser dishes for $10, so iron stone. And then I got what they said was a planter and it's actually a terrine. It's missing the lid, but it's over a hundred year old iron stone. So I'm super excited about that. And I got the game of life. She got the game of life and I got a blue vintage table that is just perfect shabby chic. I don't even have to do anything to it. It's going right in the booth. Clean it up. 
clean it, put it in the booth, it'll sell. It's so cute, it's blue, it's wonderful. See the legs back there? I don't want furniture, but there it was. And you can't pass it up. I, got, I don't have to do anything to it. No passing that one up. 15 bucks. Okay, we are leaving Winona. Can you see it? Like the car's almost full. By the time we leave Wabasha, uh, you won't be able to see out the back window is my guess. That's my guess too. I hit one sale and for $45, I got so much vintagey goodness. I can't wait to show you guys. I got these really great mid-century plastic cocktail glasses. They're with these quirky little sayings on them. Those are going on Etsy like right away. So I can't wait. Wait till you see it. We are calling it for today. <laughs> We're exhausted. <laughs> and the back of my truck is full and I don't think we can get anything else in it. <laughs> we are, that is literally falling over full. There is a scroll saw, a belt sander, belt sander. a table, oh, and tons. My big ginormous base that looks like a bowling pin. Tons of ironstone in there. Tons, tons of ironstone. I am calling home ironstone. And, um, wow, lots of vintage goodness. It's, it was a fun day. It was a good day. Then we're going to the hot tub and having some brandy. <laughs> it's day two. Dos. Dos. And uh, a little rough start, what do you think? No. No, we're up. <laughs> she said I'm not as pretty. We're not, we're not pretty. as pretty as we were yesterday. Deal with it, we're gonna go junk it. We don't gotta be pretty, right? Nope, just need the pocketbook. Little so we, money. Yeah, we hit the ATM, cause I got, uh, got some cash today. And uh, we're gonna load this thing again. It's empty, we emptied it. Now we're ready to go again. Treasures! <laughs> uh, okay, so day two update. It's lunchtime. That's what we've got. Oh, here's more sales. We're out of money. <laughs> we gotta go. I'm not. She is out of money. Jetty, you have. I'm broke. She has a dollar. I have a dollar and it's a couple quarters left. So I technically could go garage selling some more. I have a ten dollar. I have ten dollars. Eleven dollars. Yeah. And an entire car full of stuff. So I had sixty when we started. What'd you have? Um, I had ninety. So I've spent 50, a little over 50, and you've spent, because I had some change left from yesterday, and you spent 90, I've, I've 89. 89, <laughs> And even though I didn't need furniture, there's furniture back there. It was a quarter for a cabinet, and 50 cents for a stool I don't need to do anything to. The cabinet needs work. I'm in trouble, aren't I? You are. <laughs> But you should see, I got some of my client list checked off. I've got stuff for the booth, stuff for the Etsy site. Wait till you see. I'm gonna have to do like multiple haul videos for you guys for this 100 mile garage so you're not even gonna believe what we got. Just lay it all out on the yard and just stand, I stand I wouldn't be able it. to get it in before dark. <laughs> Wait till you see it. Okay, we are on day three of the 100 mile garage sale. I'm exhausted, I'm not wearing makeup today, but I'm so excited to get back out there. It's the stupidest thing, you can feel this tired and so excited to get to get going again, it's so sore. Um, my sister got up early, she's been restless because she hates the fact that everything is not packed. So she's out there packing. Uh, I'm gonna go get get out there and help her and pack some stuff she just 
She really, really likes when things are packed correctly and nothing gets broken, which I appreciate. She's my packing guru, so she is packing Fluffy the Wonder Van right now and rearranging everything so that everything we bring back tonight we can just quickly pack up and and get put in there. So I'm going to get out there and help her, and we'll be on the road. See ya. Day three. Last day of the sale. May the 4th be with you. May the 4th be with you too. May the 4th be with us. It's May the 4th. Star Wars Day. We hope our Jedi powers are going to bring us some luck. Although we've had a really great sale. Your oh. best? Um, I got a TV for $30 and I love my comforter that I got for $25. <laughs> it's a nice comforter. It's We're very nice. It's like a $100 comforter Wait, that she is got. Is Waverly? No. Um, I don't remember. No, oh, Rowley. Cynthia Rowley. Rowley. Cynthia, Cynthia Rowley. Cynthia Rowley comforter. Gorgeous piece for 25 bucks. And a what, Samsung TV? Yeah. Samsung flat screen TV for 20 bucks. It, it was running and working and we hauled it out of there. My best was everything. <laughs> I got so much stuff. She loves all her stuff. I love my stuff. My chat keys. <laughs> Love it. All right. We're going to get on the road to Wisconsin. Wisconsin. And we're going to go junk Wisconsin today. See you in a bit. We are officially leaving the safety of Minnesota. I'm apparently in the car with a felon. <laughs> <laughs> Jenny's at war with the state of Wisconsin. So we're taking our chances. It's still going anyway. <laughs> oh. Are we gonna make it? Are we on Wisconsin soil yet? No. We uh, haven't even crossed the river yet. Oh. We're almost there. Okay, as Minnesotans have long suspected, Wisconsin sucks. Yep. We are going back to Redway. <laughs> Everything, I, I have made a couple purchases, but they are so top of the mark. And if they weren't what I really needed at this time, I wouldn't have bothered. But they, I wanted to do a nautical theme, so I got a couple nautical things, and then I got uh, wheels, which are expensive. Casters. Casters, which are expensive at Menards, so they were brand new, $750 for four of them, I bought them. But other than that, we could have been skunked. By yeah. this time yesterday, this was almost full in Minnesota, so we are going back to Minnesota. To Red Wing, and we're gonna jump Red Wing today. See ya. While I'm heading home, I think it's pretty safe to say it was a successful junk run. The uh, passenger seat's full. The back's nearly full. I got a little space. I could have got more. So this is just my stuff. Uh, my sister Jenny, she's already gone. She took her stuff home in her SUV. It was full. So. Yeah, we tore it up. We tore up the 100 mile garage sale. Thanks for watching everyone. I appreciate it. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I'm gonna do some haul videos. So if you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, click the link below and click the bell icon to be notified because you're gonna wanna see what's back here. I've forgotten what's back here. So it's probably gonna be a series of junk hauls. There's just no way for me to do it in one video. It would be four hours long. <laughs> this is a lot. This is a lot. I love this. It's a chandelier. It's an amazing chandelier. I'm probably going to rewire it. It's just gorgeous. It's a very shabby chic chandelier. So I'll show you everybody. But thanks for watching, everyone. If you like this, I did that already. I'm so tired, y'all. I'm ready to go home. I'm going home. So thanks for watching. Happy junkin'. Bye. Visit my blog, peonylanedesigns.com, for more tips, tricks, and inspiration. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you like this video, 
please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon so you'll be notified of new videos. I post every week DIY tutorials and of course, more Junkin videos.